Well, a special honor for a well-known bus driver in the Fox C6 School District who was struck and killed by a car earlier this week. A fleet of buses passing in a procession to remember 72-year-old Dennis Alblain. Fox 2's Kelly Hoskins is live with a look at this honor for this veteran, a beloved community member. Kelly. Well, Vic and Jasmine, we're here on the Foxy Six School District bus parking lot. Now, this is where Dennis Ablin parked his bus every day. In fact, now a makeshift memorial stands right here behind me in his honor. His co-workers have been stopping by here all day. They say he will be missed. He's really going to be missed. Uh, this was a, a tragic end to a, a beautiful life. Trying to hold back the tears, more than 40 Fox C6 school district bus drivers participated in a procession Friday to honor 72 year old Dennis Ablin. When the buses drove by here uh, this morning with the lights flashing, everybody, everybody was waving all that. It was just kind of a salute to uh, Dennis, the big lovable guy that he was, you know. St. Louis County Police say Ablin was struck and killed by a 16 year old driver Tuesday in the 3200 block of Country Hollow Drive. Police are currently investigating the crash as a homicide. Ablin's co workers are devastated. Any bus driver is a loss, but he was just above and beyond. He, everything he did was uh, top notch. You could always count on him to uh, help you out. Investigators say the deadly crash unfolded around 6 when officers responded to a call for an assault. Upon arrival, officers found Ablin struck by a vehicle. He was transported to a hospital where he later died. A memorial stands in the district bus parking lot in his honor, as his co-workers have been stopping by all day, bringing stuffed animals and flowers. They wanted to memorialize him, saying he served the district proud. The 72-year-old was also a veteran who served in the Navy, who was always lending a helping hand. Wherever he goes, he becomes one of those go-to guys where you can count on him to get the job done. No matter what task that is, all the drivers liked him. They, uh, he did stuff for them every day. He'd go fuel their buses, get them started on cold mornings, always just helping everybody he could. Authorities say the 16-year-old remained on scene and cooperated with the investigation. The juvenile suspect was taken into custody and referred to family court. Now, funeral arrangements are still pending, and police say that this is an ongoing investigation. Reporting live from Arnold, Kelly Hoskins, Fox 2 News.